Verification of Snell's Law Using Huygens Principle Snell's Law can be verified using Huygens Principle. First, we have to determine the secondary wave front using Huygens construction. AB is a surface separating two media, 1 and 2, in which light travels with velocities C1 and C2 respectively. Let light travel from medium 1 to medium 2 so that AP is the incident wavefront in medium 1, while BE is the refracted wavefront in the other medium. The incident and refracted wavefronts make angles I and R respectively with surface AB. An incident ray LPO is perpendicular to the wavefront AD, for which the corresponding refracted ray OQ is at right angles to wavefront BE. The total time taken by the ray to travel from the incident wavefront to the refracted wavefront is T is equal to PO by C1 plus OQ by C2, that is equal to AO sin I by C1 plus OB sin R by C2. This time should be independent of all the incident rays. For this, the coefficient of OA in the relation 1 should be 0. That is, sin I by C1 is equal to sin R by C2. Or sin I by sin R is equal to C1 by C2. That is equal to 1 mu 2. Where 1 mu 2 is the refractive index of medium 2 with respect to medium 1. Example, when medium 1 is air, and medium 2 is water, relation sin i by sin r is equal to 1 mu 2 is Snell's law.